all right y'all welcome back to another turkey pattern test video here today it's been a little while since we brought out anything in the 410 so i've been wanting to get back and test some 410 out and i've got a couple new loads to put through this mossberg so first up is the browning 410 tss loads these are three inch 1100 feet per second 13 16 ounce of number nines and for the setup we're going to be running them through I've got my Mossberg 500 410 turkey back out again and to start out with I've got the stock extra full turkey choke in the gun this is a 380 constriction choke so definitely a little bit more on the tighter end for 410 consider most people run 385 383 390 somewhere in there so we'll see what these Brownings do out of it and they might like the tight choke or they might like a little bit more open choke I don't know from what I've seen, these Brownings can give a little bit of a mixed result. Sometimes they perform okay, and other times it's not very good. I don't know. Maybe it's a consistency issue. It is a big box store, off-the-shelf load, so you never quite know what you're getting into with one of those. But as per usual, I've got a turkey target set up over here. It's going to be 40 yards from the bench, so let's go put these Browning 9-shot TSS loads through this Mossberg 500 with the stock 380 extra full and see what they can do on the paper. All right, we're all set up over here at the bench at 40 yards, so let's run these Browning 13 16 ounce of number 9s through this Mossberg 500 410 turkey with the stock extra full 380 choke and see what they can do. all right so here's what we got out of that stuff i'm not really impressed with it to be honest yes it will kill you a turkey at 40 yards but there's not really a defined core and there's just kind of shot all over the paper here it's definitely better than the federals that we tested but I'm not totally sold on that one yet. It's just, it, it doesn't have a really defined core. It's not a super even pattern. There's pretty big voids throughout it. I don't know. It's, it's not a terrible pattern, but it's definitely not impressive. I'll say that much. There are definitely way better loads out there for your 410 than this stuff. So far, anyway, out of this gun and this choke. We'll have to test this stuff some more once I get some different chokes and see if we can get it tuned in any better than that, but I have a feeling that's about what it's going to give us, which isn't anything super impressive, but it's not super terrible either, I suppose. All right, well, what do y'all think about it? It's not a terrible pattern, but it's definitely nothing impressive, I'll say that. If that's what you've got available and can get your hands on, it will take a turkey out to 40, but it's definitely not the best stuff out there. And even for the big box store stuff, the herders will outperform that any day of the week. I don't know. It's nothing super impressive, but it's, it's not a horrible pattern either. It's definitely not as bad as the Federals. The Federals just do not like that gun or setup or anything from my experience. But I don't know. What do y'all think? Are you happy enough with that pattern? Are you disappointed in it? Or is that about what you expected? That's about what I expected to see just from what I've seen before out of those Brownings from different people that have tested them. They seem to do okay. Not terrible, not great, but okay. And I think that's pretty much what we saw here. They're okay, they will take a turkey at 40, but they're nothing special or nothing super impressive so we'll have to test those out of some different chokes as i start getting them in for that gun to see if we can find something a little bit better than that but if i had to take a guess now that's about what we're gonna see out of this shell not terrible not amazing it will just kill you a turkey at 40 and that's about the extent of it it's definitely nothing super impressive but leave a comment and let me know what y'all think about it. Do you like it? Do you not like it? Is there something better out there that you guys would like to see? Let me know down below. And good luck as everybody's getting out there in the turkey woods this spring. It's been tough going for me, but 
that's just turkey hunting and that's the way it goes sometimes but i've got some more pattern testing to do today while i got a few hours so with that being said i'll see y'all in the next one